Legislative IQ. Increase your legislative intelligence with Florida's policy, budget, and campaign monitoring service. Subscribe today at legislativeiq.com. Students are coming back to campus at Florida State. Daniel Bryan is helping his stepdaughter get settled, but he'll go back to New Jersey afterwards. So safety is a priority. She has a pretty good head on her shoulders, uh, but you know we can never emphasize safety too much. Florida State Police and Tallahassee law enforcement are investigating a recent string of attempted abductions. The latest one may be the most concerning. It happened in broad daylight. The most recent attempted abduction happened right here on this street this past Wednesday, just two blocks from campus. I want to start off with talking about your students. Major Jim Russell with FSU Police spoke to parents about campus safety during an orientation Friday morning. It's a college environment. And you're surrounded by really nice people with a, with a common goal, but there's criminals out there too. Andrew Grant was in attendance. He and his wife are going back to London and won't be able to monitor their son as often as some other parents, but they're not worried. It's not a concern to us, to be perfectly honest, and hearing that presentation makes it even less of a concern. Major Russell says students and parents can use simple tips to try and stay safe. Not walking alone at night, avoiding isolation, staying in well-lit areas, all those things that we all do, make sure you put those in place here, too, on campus and around campus if you happen to live off campus. The new semester for Florida State starts Monday. Reporting in Tallahassee, I'm Matt Gelka.